Namaste and very welcome to my YouTube channel, the Smart Learning Center, to all the students of management and different other faculties as well. So uh, today I'm going to discuss about the very important chapter, very important topic that is strategic management. Uh, this is very important for actual science students uh, who are studying in, in uh, actual science, that is uh, business management and BBS level, BBS third year level students of Tribune University and different other universities students. And basically this is related to uh, business in my business management and uh, this is important for BBS third year students that is business environment and strategic management. So exactly uh, different business has its one goal, purpose, objective. And on the basis of this goal objectives, we have to make different types of plans and policies. Yeah, you know very well about that. There are uh, basically there are two types of plan. One is short term plan, and you know there is long term, and that is we call strategical plan. So uh, in my discussion, um, only focused uh, that is uh, strategical uh, plan policies and how this strategy is managed properly. So, exactly what is the meaning of strategic management? Some point of Vidyarthi, either concerned to say, within the university, it may be Tirvan University, Purvantri University, Kathmandu University, even Indian University, within the students, like say, Ekdame Habdik Swagat Garde, any like, subscribe, Gurna Bhatsa, and Evani. My YouTube channel, the Smart Learning Center, like, subscribe, and it is the pure academic channel. But within the subject matter, ka container, subject, related container. So, strategic management is the management of an organization's resources to achieve its goals and objectives. Yeah, we know. Every business, it may be small or big one. Giant business by a small business by a perfect business coach, goal and objective predetermined. That the predetermined goal objective fulfilled Garnakulagi, we need different types of resources in organization. So, such activities, such resources, if we utilize maximum utility, Garamli, Hamro objective, say, fulfilled Garsovari, that is simply we can say that strategic management. So, strategic management involves. Setting objectives, analyzing the competitive environment. Yeah, it is important. We have to analyze the different environmental factors. You know, basically there are two environmental uh, components or factors, internal and external. Sappai kuraro, sappai environment lai chai, I mean, analysis garnu panni huncha. So, analyzing the internal organizations, different things, evaluating strategies and uh, ensure, ensuring that management rolls out the strategic across the organizations. Simply all the resources and all the activities we have to utilize to get the predetermined goal of business institutions that we have to understand. Strategic management extends to, to internal and external communication practices as well as to, to tracking, uh, which ensures that the companies meets company meets goals as defined in a in its strategic management plan strategic management is nothing but planning for both pre predictable as well as unfeasible contingencies basically we, we exactly we can't predict about uh, the future so we have to make plan policies and rules and regulations for getting any predetermined mm -hmm. objectives in the future it is applicable to both small as well as the large uh, organizations as even the smallest organization face competition and by formulating and implementing appropriate strategies, they can attain sustainable competitive advantages. So, yeah, strategic management is, starts from uh, formulating of different plans and policies, rules and regulations of any institutions. On the basis of these different plans and policies, rules and regulations, uh, such activities must be implemented by different level of human resources. Yeah, we know uh, we need different types of human resources in, in institutions or organizations. 
such a, a formulating plan and policies must be implemented and implementing plans and policies must be evaluated evaluated and on the basis of evaluation of these different policies plans rules and regulations we have to we have to get the feedback from different areas then on the basis of these different uh, part these different uh, steps of strategic management then we will analyze exactly what happened and what are the uh, lacking differences deviation plan and exactly uh, reality ma key differences for we can analyze so strategic management is the process of getting goal of any institutions uh, uh, procedures and objectives in order to make a companies and organization more competitive yeah there is vast competition in reality there are different competitors so how we can compete to to these uh, competitors uh, to get maximum utility to get maximum profit and profitability of our business typically strategic management looks at effectively uh, deploying staffs you know yeah, we have to 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 motivate to energize our different staffs and human resources and resources to achieve these goals often uh, strategic management includes strategy evaluation internal organization analysis and st strategy execution throughout the company different steps must be implemented and such uh, steps are very important to get uh, a strategic goal as well so companies universities non-profit and other different organizations can use strategic management as a way to get to to make a goals and meet objectives flexible companies may find it easier to make changes to their structures and plans while uh, inflexible companies may difficult to change business environment and we have to understand uh, future is uncertainty and we need to change uh, to get different things and change management is needed in any either in companies universities and non-profit institutions as well so a strategic manager may, may oversee different strategic management plans and, and, and device way for organizations to meet their benchmark goals. Uh, on the basis of our discussion, exactly the theme of strategic management is the, uh, the ongoing process of upsetting and organizations high level goals, developing plans of uh, active and effectively allocating resources to execute those plans. This is the gist of this strategic management. So uh, in same way, strategic management is the management of an organization's resources in order to achieve its goal and objectives. In short, that we can say that strategic management uh, is, a, is a management of uh, organization's resources in order to achieve its different goals and objectives. <clears throat> yeah, same on the basis of these things. Again, we, we can say that exactly what is strategic management. Strategic management is a continuous process that evaluates and control the business and its industry and the industries in which an organization is evolved, evaluates its competitors and set goals and strategies to meet all existing and potential competitors, and then uh, re-evaluate strategies on a regular basis to, to determine how it has been implemented and whether it was successful or does it need replacement? Yeah, already I have uh, discussed above. Yeah, we need to uh, analyze the different strategies uh, on the basis of demand of customers, on the basis of need of different markets, uh, prospectives, we have to need to change our strategy because um, all the demand, all the, the perception of customers may change. Strategic management uh, gives a broader perspective to the employees of an organization and they can better understand how their job fits into the uh, entire organizational plan and how it is correlated to other organizations member as well because human resources are the very important key resources of any institutions 
they are assets, they are capital of the business. So we have to utilize and we have to understand the, the role and responsibilities of different human resources. And on the basis of uh, skill, quality, knowledge, interest, then we have to delegate the duty and responsibilities that is we call job fit. And then we will uh, able to get our predetermined goal of an institution. The set of decisions and actions that result in the formulation and implementation of plans designed to achieve a company's objectives. So uh, today's my discussion is only concerned to strategic management. What is strategic management and how strategic management is, is, is uh, practically implemented and what are the different steps shortly I discussed. And it is very important for all level of management students and not only students, all management practitioners, businessmen and employees as well. So if uh, you say Mero video, if you like this, please, uh, you have to subscribe, uh, like, and I need constructive feedback from your side. And thank you very much. Thank you. Then, you want to see the video, I will be in the management card by strategic, strategic management related. Be in the video, I will be in the YouTube channel. Like, subscribe, thank you very much. Thank you.